and action. Butterfly Love from Above, written by Melissa Stewart. Star lit up every room she entered with her bright smile and playful imagination. She loved twirling around the house, pretending to be a ballerina, and daydreaming of chasing butterflies. Star had lots of friends, but one was special. It was a beautiful butterfly. But not just any butterfly. It was her butterfly. She caught her Twinkle. Twinkle knew the exact time each day Star came home from school and would greet her with excitement. She flapped her bright, twinkling wings and flew circles around the little girl. Twinkle landed on top of Star's head. Star giggled. I knew you were up there, Twinkle. Twinkle whispered. Always look up. I'm right here, little Star. Star and Twinkle spent every afternoon together. <laughs> when Star skipped around the yard, singing, twirling around like a ballerina, Twinkle seemed to twirl with her. When Star pretended to be a wild pony <laughs> galloping through the wide open sunflower fields, the butterfly flapped her wings as fast as she could to keep up with her. One cold rainy day, Star put on her favorite unicorn rain boots and jumped around in muddy puddles. To keep from getting her wings splashed on, Twinkle flew high above and out of sight. Star looked all around and called out, Twinkle, Twinkle! Twinkle flew as fast as her soft, silky little wings could to get to the little girl. And softly in the wind, she whispered, Always look up. I'm right here, little star. The next day, a dark, gloomy cloud hovered above Star. She ran home as fast as she could, and when she arrived, she called out for her friend. But the butterfly wasn't there. She waited and waited, but Twinkle did not come. The same thing happened the next day, and the day after that. The sky was still gloomy, and Star was so sad. Twinkle is always going to be here, said her mom, pointing at Star's heart. All the precious moments you shared are like a treasure chest, to which only you hold the key. Those special memories are proof that love lasts forever even when the one we love is no longer here. Star placed her little hand on her heart and closed her eyes. She pictured a special moment she and Twinkle had shared and smiled. The dark clouds slowly moved and the warm sun shined down on her. Softly, the wind seemed to whisper, Always look up. I'm right here, little star. A few days later, her mom took her for a drive. I have a surprise, her mom promised. They pulled up to her horse stable and Star bursted with excitement. A trailer pulled up and out came a beautiful white pony with a dark mane. The pony greeted her with her kind, soulful eyes. Her name is Luna, Star's mom said. She came all the way across the country to be here with her new owner. Who is her new owner? Star asked. You are, Star. She belongs to you now. Star's face lit up. She couldn't believe that this beautiful pony was really hers. The days that followed were magical. Star and Luna rode through the sunflower fields, jumped logs, and went on long trail rides together. Luna, I wish every kid could have a friend like you, Star sighed happily. Luna gently nuzzled the little girl's cheek to let her know she understood. One day at school, she noticed a few kids with sadness in their eyes. She remembered feeling that way when Twinkle left, and she wanted to help. Mom, do you think we could invite some friends from school to meet Luna? Maybe Luna can brighten their day just like she does mine. She asked after school. I think that's a lovely idea, Star. 
Mom replied. The next day, Star and a few friends from her class met at the barn. Their eyes lit up at the sight of her pony. Luna slowly dipped her head low enough for each child to reach out and gently touch her. At that very moment, two beautiful butterflies flew down overhead. The kids looked up in amazement. Star had tears in her eyes. They reminded her of Twinkle, but where she used to feel sadness, Star now felt joy. Star put her hand across her heart as she gazed through the tall trees. Her mom came over there to her. Luna's name means moon, and mine is Star. Isn't that amazing, Mommy? She beamed. Mommy smiled and said, It's more than amazing. It's a match made in heaven. They both looked to the clear blue sky above as the sun shined brightly upon them. Even then, the wind seemed to whisper, Always look up. I'm right here, little star.